for like trivia questions dude like that's such a good trivia question for like those like the, for people who say that they've been around for a while oh we got diamond pistols let's go hell yeah let's go baby and it, it didn't tell me that i got the camo but let's go yo what's up guys foxy coming to you guys today with a brand new video hope you guys are all having a fantastic day hope you guys all had a fantastic thanksgiving if you guys didn't check out yesterday's video on the diamond launcher and all that good stuff Make sure you guys go do that. We got the diamond knife and diamond launcher, but it's all kind of a lock still. I don't really know why. But in today's video, we unlocked diamond pistols in Black Ops Cold War, and these are sexy! Only problem is I just can't stop using the magnums when I'm using the pistols now. After running the other pistols, the only pistol I really want to run is the magnum. And the akimbo magnum on top of that, and that's broken as everyone knows. I hope you guys do enjoy this video. If you guys do, make sure you guys leave a like down below subscribe turn on notifications all that good jazz go follow me on twitch it's down in the description below we stream over there every single night around 8 30 9 o'clock p.m eastern time and we'll be grinding out shotguns tonight as well let me know what other stuff you guys want me to cover if you guys want me to do video settings controller settings any of that stuff let me know down in the comments what you guys want to see and without further ado let's go bros all right so the biggest tip i could give you guys for these pistols all of them like literally all of them every single one when you unlock the akimbo attachment for the Renettis or the Diamatis or the RK5, whatever you want to call it. And for the Magnums, just use the Kimbo. Y'all will thank me later. I promise. Because this is probably the only secondary I'm going to use other than the Hair 77 shotgun. Because they're so nasty. Like, bro. Alrighty then. Yeah, see, this one's flipped. There's one guy. Here we go. I don't know where they're spawning at. I've been kind of trying to see if I can get some reactions out of this, but I don't really know if I'm going to. I haven't really been having the best time playing on Nuketown. I feel like these would look awesome with the the I can't remember what this what it's called. The I'm just gonna call it the purple diamond. Is it plague diamond? Plague diamond for zombies? I feel like these would look insane with plague diamond. I've only run into a couple people running these. My nice spawn game. I've only run into a couple people running these. We ran into one person today on stream. It was pretty insane. Yo, what are you camping in? This is why Nuketown just pisses me the fuck off now bro kids play so fucking lame bro goodbye i feel like this map is so small that people are, aren't really playing it the way that it was built to be played dude sometimes these things have like no recoil <laughs> at all No, dude, no. Oh my God, dude. That was so many guys right there. They were literally all coming for me. <laughs> this isn't too bad of a lobby. I mean, it's okay. No. Oh my God. Now I went and played hardcore for all the pistols until I got a Kimbo on them. At least for the Magnums, I didn't keep playing hardcore because once you get into core with these, they're just, they're legendary, bro. They're just absolutely insane. I know that I just died right there, but we dropped a nuclear with these. So if you guys haven't checked out that video, make sure you guys go do that. We were doing launchers and then I ended up trying to show the stream how OP these were. And then we ended up dropping a nuclear. So yeah nice nice camping nice camping it's one thing to get into somebody's base and then kind of hide out in the base and kind of you know kill them while you're in their base but to sit there and hide in your base the entire time is ridiculous in my opinion like look at that range look at that range bro what are your guys thoughts on nuketown i feel like i'm not the only person that feels a certain way about this map right now i just want to know what you guys think of it because i'm just not the biggest fan of this at the moment the biggest thing is people don't move in addition with people not moving they're just kind of head glitched with m16s augs and you know mp5s or whatever and then lastly the streak system i feel like the streak system is just it's this is shipment 1944 with requisitions all over again and it really disappoints me another thing to be known about these is that you get 12 rounds in each gun which is just absolutely nuts because the snake shots only had six in each in each gun damn Damn. Outplayed there, bro. 
No, dude. Fuck. The camo challenge that gave me the most trouble with the pistols was the headshots. And then on top of it, the kills behind cover. It wasn't that the kills behind cover were they, they were hard. It was just kind of tedious. I thought that they would be way harder because pistols and all that stuff. But if you guys go to hardcore, it'll be super easy to do that challenge. And do you see what I mean by the streak system, bro? Artillery's out the ass. A bunch of just firebombing runs or napalm strikes, whatever you want to call them. It's just ridiculous. Sorry, I feel like I'm bitching a lot, but it's... I just don't like this map. We're going to go play another... We're going to go play regular core with without Nuketown. We're not going to play Nuketown 24-7 anymore. Yeah, kids who are going 28 and 27 and they're dropping, you know, higher streaks. It's just ridiculous. I was looking over the challenges again, and I remembered that the long shots were a little bit of a pain, at least with the 1911. I, like I said before, I would just go to hardcore for those because then you, you'll easily just be able to do that. And yeah, that, that's how I would go about doing those. How do we get the last shotgun gold? and then we get diamond shotguns i think i'm gonna move into the snipers because then i have all the secondaries done and that'll be really nice i wonder if he oh he pushed yeah of course yeah dude i just this is just like fucking insane why am i going up against the dude these guys literally apparently everyone's getting told that they're a reverse booster now because i just got told that i am reverse boosting apparently uh this is weird it, it's it's very very weird honestly this map is huge so if i start using the m16 don't get mad at me so i think it's really weird that just because people do well in a game means that they reverse boost uh as you guys can see i'm dying a ton right now this game i'm not even gonna lie bro this game has been testing my patience all day today bro it's dude it's literally i cannot with this i can't i'm i'm done i'm done for the day